Hey guys, this would be your girl Selena coming to you. It's October the 5th, 2011. Um, I just wanted to come, here today, come to you today and show you my hair. Um, my my homegirl basically braided it into a mohawk. And she like did like a few designs or whatever it was. And everything. And um, basically what on the top of it we had, I, we were trying to do um, this two strand twist method by Miss V Charles. Um, it didn't really exactly come out how I basically wanted it to, but for the most part, um, it's cute like this. It looks like little dreads and everything, so yeah. I uh, like well, this morning whenever I woke up, I uh, took a shower and everything like that, and um, make sure it was just like really wet and everything and then I have put some of the gel on there basically to find it and um so it, to, to define it and make sure that it stays all day um what I did is that I had like very little of the curling custom left it was probably like right here and um what I did is that I took my eco solid gel um but the argan oil style now. Took a little bit of this, just a spoonful, and I put it in here. And then I also took some of the olive oil eco style gel. Oops, sorry. And um, just a spoonful. And from before that, I showed you a long time ago that I have oils mixed together. And again, those oils would be jojoba oil, olive oil, Jamaican black cash oil, have some food glycerin. Um, and I don't believe that I have any more avocado oil or anything like that. But basically, I have my little color bottle that I got from Sally's. And put that in here. And then I just put some water and just stirred it up, basically. Um, I put water in there so it could be a little bit looser so it won't be so thick. Because um, if you've ever used the Kinky Curly Curling Custard, it's not thick. It's it's really loose. I put like a little bit of... Um, some moisturizing and stuff exactly what it is. I'm not sure I'm gonna put a little bit up in there because it actually started to turn a little white but if you can see it looks whiter on camera than what it really is I think but I just put a little bit up in there because I didn't want it to be too white because I it's gonna be my first time ever doing it and I didn't want my hair I didn't want it to come out bad basically. Um like all I had was a little bit of curling um, kinky curly curling custard left and like so all I did was use a spoonful of each so I wasn't going to be like I was really wasting anything but for the most part I, I think it came out alright um I, I just love the smell of the kinky curly curling custard so that's that's basically why I did it um but anyways back to my hair I guess I'll just turn around and let you see everything Okay. So. I wish I would have took pictures yesterday when she did it. Um, when she did it though, because this right here is my first time ever um, rocking the mohawk, and I was a little, little bit skeptical about what I was going to do with with everything else. Because it was already planned out that we were going to do this. We were going to try to do this to my whole head, but the thing was that back here in the back, these right here came out more like curls instead of dreads. So I was just like, we'll just comb it out and I'll just, um, or I'll throw it out. I was like, I'll just leave this right here as is. And at the same time, I was just like, mm, I'm not really feeling it because I've had another one of my homegirls braid up my hair into a mohawk. And um, I, didn't, I didn't like the way how this side of my head looked. So... I basically took down this side and left this side up and just had my braids on one side 
And then if I didn't like the way how the back of it looked, I just basically left the braids right here done and took out the back side too. So, yeah. Oh, yeah. Do y'all like my glasses? They are cute. I got them from, um, uh, what's the name of the store? City Trans. Because I went in there with my homegirl and I'm trying to get something for church. But I saw and I was like, oh, they're cute. I was like, I don't really rock glasses like this because I don't ever feel like they really fit my face. But I think because of how my hair saw is, I think it goes perfect together. Don't you think? Oh. But they were like two ninety nine, so I had got them. Hey, so these are here are my favorite glasses. I got these right here for ninety nine cents. Yeah, I think I like the other ones better right now. But, if y'all like the way it looks, um, I'll try to do like a little tutorial for you next time. Alright guys, I guess I'll go ahead and end here and I hope that y'all all enjoyed this video. Please remember to rate, comment, and subscribe. Bye.